the Lakers have offered an improved Anthony Davis package. Is this news? Yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. This is uh, this is news. We've had a lot of Anthony Davis news, it feels like, over the last 48 hours or so. Last it's, two weeks, yeah, it seems like. Yeah, it, it's even ramping up even more. We had Anthony Davis Sr., his dad, saying he doesn't want his son to play in Boston. That was his opinion. We had a checklist sort of of teams that Anthony Davis reportedly would maybe sign long-term with. That's out there. And we've had offers, two offers, by way of the Lakers. It started with what we're calling the underwhelming offer. I guess Woj originally called it that. <laughs> it's the Fire Festival right. of packages. Yeah, Lonzo Ball, Kyle Kuzma, mm, geez, Rondo Beasley, and a first-round pick. Well, then today, today, after the LA Times reported, you know, that Pelicans wanted more. They wanted a counter. They wanted some more picks. I guess what we're calling it is the Godfather offer. Some are calling it the Godfather 3 offer because some people aren't all that high on it. But it makes a lot more sense, at least. Ingram, Ball, Kuzma, Lance, and Rondo, and Beasley. Two first-round picks, and then coming back would be sort of Anthony Davis and Solomon Hill, because they want to get off that hmm. uh, that contract that Hill signed when he signed that four-year, 48. So, a lot of news here. What do you make, I guess, really of this? The potential of this happening, that Godfather offer again with Solomon Hill going with AD back to the Lakers. You think this goes down, or are they going to wait? They should wait. They still that should wait. That trade will be there in the summer. It, it should be there. There isn't another plan for the Lakers to go get another superstar. Anthony Davis is their plan. And Pelicans should wait to see what the Boston Celtics can offer. Because I'm still not pumped about this offer. It's about quality, not quantity. Basically, the Lakers would become the Pelicans without LeBron James. And that team, without LeBron James, is 6-12 and 12 this season. They haven't been good. Are those first picks enough to sell the Pelicans? Those picks aren't going to be all that great either. I still think the Celtics have a better package to offer. I would wait. I would e call e this the Godfather 3 package. Yeah. There's a lot of names. They're giving them the whole team. But this team was 6-12. and 12. Yeah, This and team wasn't all that good. Guys like Rondo and Beasley, obviously they're just throw-ins. They're not part of your future. Stevenson as well. So it's basically Ingram, Ball, Kuzma in those two picks. And whether or not even Ball and his family have already talked about not wanting to be in your league, yeah. so they probably have to move on from him. But I agree, if Tatum is still available, if the Celtics have in some way inclined that they will move Jason Tatum, then you don't take this offer, you wait. Because Tatum might be available, and also Zion might be available. You just don't know who's going to have that pick. If you're the Pelicans, there's no need to rush. There's no need to rush right now. The Lakers do need to rush because they want to make sure they get this offer in and, and accept it before it does get to summer. But this is basically the best they can offer. And if you're the Pelicans... I think you just go, you know what, we're going to wait and see what we can do in, uh, in July. Yeah, that is the truth. There's not much more that the Lakers could offer. Right? I mean, Zubats could be thrown in there. Maybe some, some swap picks uh, could be yeah. thrown in there as well. But there's really, the, like those young guys. And look, the Pelicans reportedly want multiple young players. That does, that, you know, check there yeah. with these guys if you believe in Ingram and Kuzma. And They're Ball. not old. They're definitely not old. They want some picks. You know, check again. They may not be the greatest, sexiest picks in the world, but check. Yeah. And, you know, there is that idea of they want to get Solomon Hill in there, the Pelicans do, a little more cap relief, you know, so open up some more space. And, you know, again, check again if this reported deal is true here. So you know, I hear you with the waiting for Tatum, but the whole problem there is this report that Anthony Davis doesn't want to sign there long term. Yeah. And why is that getting out there? Now, is that AD's uh, you know, agent leaking that out there and saying that's the plan, or is that just that he doesn't want to go there? That sort of muddles it a little bit with the whole waiting game uh, mm -hmm. approach. But you still think, well, who cares? Yeah. The Lakers are still going to have these guys, and they're still going to want to offer them up for Anthony Davis. I would think so. Yeah. And, and Boston uh, is still going to be there in June. I don't think they're going to be scared off by the fact that Anthony Davis right. reportedly wouldn't sign there. They've got the Tatum factor, I, I believe, is a, has better star potential than any of those Lakers, and they have the picks factor because they own picks besides their own picks. Right. They've got the Grizzlies pick. They've got the Clippers pick, which, which could be a, a lot better. I don't think there's any reason for Dell Demps to pull the trigger now, and as you mentioned, we'll see who gets the number one pick because maybe you can turn right. Turn uh, Anthony Davis into the number one pick. It, it, it's it's premature. I think you'd be making a mistake to make this deal now. And, and I know we've been the ones talking up Ben Simmons as a possibility. It, I think that is a better option than even than some of these Lakers. Like yeah, you. It's it's about quality in this league. You don't want to be a a team that's sort of an also red like the Lakers have been. Yeah, maybe Ingram and Kuzma, and those guys can turn it on, but they haven't been great. Yeah. And and Ben Simmons again, if he's available, who knows? And Jason Tatum, I think, have more star potential.